Did you see that? And did you hear that? That is the new Pavlov update 29 announcing that crossplay for PlayStation and PC is now is one. And that means we could play with more PC players and PlayStation players can play with PC and it's really good. And this is good news because it's just gonna get better because apparently we got some new maps, some new stuff, some new maps, some Dizzo, and we even have mods. Yeah, they're in the trailer. They said there was mods and there was new characters as well, and this is gonna be good. That means we got more people to interact with, especially the PS5 VR community was very small and you always ran into the same people, but always had a great time with them. I actually ran into the very first PC player in Pavlov. It was just me and him, one on one, -on -one, -on -one conversation in the lobby, and he was telling me that Pavlov died down and now it's going to come back because of this update. And the guy I was talking to, he was saying the community on PC is a bit toxic, depending who you run into. But in the PlayStation community, I'll show you an example of what we deal with in Pavlov VR on the PS5. You want a job? What job do you give? Yeah, um, job prostitution. Job prostitution. Firstly, you pick a shipping container and that's where you do it. Shoot a shimmy, yo! Don't just shoot a shimmy! Get some more, boy! Damn, cunts. Assassination. This is a public execution. Guys, we did God's, uh, guys, we did God's work. This is a public execution. I don't fucking care, I'm also a traitor, so I don't fucking care, you can shoot me. Fucking do it! No! Fucking shoot me! Shoot me! Fucking shoot me! I don't worry, you're the best poor, the best worker we have! I didn't want to do it! Alright, we need a promotion. Someone has to take his place as the traitor. I can't wait to see the future of Pavlov grow even better than it ever was with this update, giving us more opportunity to interact with other players and probably more content to come more in the future. Especially it's its first update in a long time and I hope they will keep doing more updates to engage us with more things to do with this game because this is... Some people will say it is, but some people won't say it's not, but I say it's the best VR shooter game, and I hope things will go well with it. So I will catch everyone later. See you next time.